Hi friends. This is not a 30 Yanks video. This is a new package. So get this open. Not any paperwork. What do we have here? Oh, I got a sticker. Looks like an Iro Shizuku ink, and I'm gonna guess based on that clip, a pilot. And, wow, interesting. I never seen this before. They have papers. Wow, and this box is nice. What's happening? What, what did I get here? Watermelon. Mm. But to start a show, let's be real. I mean, how many of you saw this pen and thought, oh, Maria is getting that? Do I ever even say this is Maria? I don't. It's in the name of my channel, though. Okay, ready? Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. I got an ink cartridge. Boop, 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 boop. And a product information warranty and sh pre shredded paper. What? I'm so excited. Yes. Yes. It's the rose tea. I'm going to be honest. I don't love the glitter distribution in this off the bat. But I will eventually. Sunk cost fallacy will take care of that. Here it is. I like actually this nib is nicely proportionate. So this is the um, rose tea pen, the Bennu Euphoria rose tea, which is a collaboration between Bennu and Goulet pens. Um, I saw that pink champagne is that what it's called and I thought it looked too gold, though I have since seen one in person and my opinion has changed. And it's very tempting. But this, the second I saw it, I was I, I was glad that I hadn't got gotten the the other. And I wasn't sure about the Euphoria. I do like the size of the talisman better, but the Euphoria is fine. It is a little big for my hands, but not that big. I certainly have pins that are equally as large. However, we got to pick an ink. So, I was thinking, to look through. So we've got floating cloud. This could work, it's a bit light. In this lighting, this isn't coming up very accurate. Maybe if I hold it up here. Floating cloud, Sailor Sakura, uh, Shikiori Sakura Mori, mm, not quite right. Definitely not right. Tsutsuji, honestly, would be pretty good. I mean, when is Tsutsuji ever the wrong answer? Never. Unless it's like, the question's like, what's a horrible ink and it's the wrong answer. Lamy Vibrant Pink, look what has happened up here. That's funky. Uh, Ackerman Poultry Pink. Not bad. Oh, Diamine Claret. I am pretty sure this is going to be the winner. Yes, if it's good, but no. Yamabuto, slightly too purple. And then we get into not pinks. So, I think... It's going to be between Diamine Claret or Wearing Ghoul Floating Cloud. Which would be your vote? I'm going to leave them here for you. 
you let me know which you would pick, okay? Okay, I'm back. Which one did you pick? Or, here's another question. If, do you have an ink that would be good for this? Look at this section. So I got this with a medium nib. Look at the nib's a little loose. I'm gonna tighten that. Just a little. I'm paranoid about new pins <clears throat> after having had a not great experience with a very expensive new pin. We're rinsing it. Just got some water here. This is a spoiler too, because you know this is gonna be one of my 30 inks pens. You do know that, right? Okay. And now the winner is Diamine Claret. I mean, it's just, it's really perfect. Really perfect. I did grab Claret, yes. Okay. We're doing some accidental, incidental chromatography. Paper towel chromatography, I think, uh, as the lovely Amanda has coined it. I, I got this. Do you want to know what restraint is? I got this, but it came. My partner said, hey, do you want to play some Halo? And I love Halo and I love my partner. And I was like, okay. And I chose that over this pin for the moment. I want to write 30 up here since I will be using it for 30 inks. Let us find a page that we can do a new pin day in on. Oh, I did have a new pin day that I never actually showed you. That's on here, but don't pay attention to that. Those are spoilers for a game that you don't know what it is, but I'm sure it's still a spoiler. So new pin day. This is the Fenu Euphoria Rose Tea. I got this with a medium nib. Now. Slightly not as good that way. So I'll take a look at that later. Pretty nice writer. Ink is Diamine Claret. I know this is a scrawl, but like I'm used to writing just thoughts and stuff really quickly. And if I don't write fast, man, I lose my thoughts. If you know what these numbers are for, let me know. Um, anyway. I love it. I love it. And I love the way that it caps so that the facets line up. 
Should I do a comparison to some things? Oh, I have exactly one pin near me, but it's a good universal size comparison. <laughs> if you've never seen a Benu Euphoria, here it is next to a Twisby Eco. This is a glow purple. And um, the Sailor Hikoro. Next to uh well what else is a universal size? Well the the Hobonichi Weeks. Uh here it is compared to a Google TV remote. And Let's see, here it is compared to the length of a coloring card, mm -hmm. an uncap. Yep, we'll uncap with the Twisby too, I guess. I can't uncap the remote. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There we go. Almost the same there. This posts nice. It's a real, it posts securely and deeply. Look at it not coming off real good I think I could even yeah it's a multi poster so compared to the Twisby look at that this is far better poster so oh I'll hear it we'll do one more size comparison here it is next to a um, cotton bud that was used to clean some blue ink out of a cap. Uh, I hope you can appreciate my new pin and my perfect size comparisons. <laughs> totally professional. I'm really excited. I wish I could use this right now. Here's my one gripe. Upside down. What are they thinking? Upside down. I suppose if I post it, it's the right way up. Oh, this is sparkly, but I don't post my pens. Only monsters do that. Just kidding. Here we are. The new, the new Euphoria. Rose tea, Goulet exclusive. Inked with diamine. Claret. I hope when I, oh, let me ask you a question. Are you going to get this pen? Do you have this pen? Did you get this pen? Do you have any Bennu pens? And do you have a favorite? Great. Thank you. I hope whenever you're watching this, you're having a wonderful day. Take care of yourselves. Bye.